There's been so many times that I've given up in my life. I didn't keep going. I didn't push forward. And because of that, those things never came to fruition. And I always wondered how things would have been if I had continued. Would I be a 17 year old at the same place right now? Or would I be to the same spot even at 21? I think I would definitely have been further ahead because not giving up is the hard thing to do. And the hard thing to do is often what gives good results. As Eastern philosophy says, good karma is what keeps the world going. And when you're faced with a tough challenge, not giving up is what will most likely get you the results. And not overthinking it in order to avoid work. Even right now with my current project, I sometimes have felt like giving up. But that's when I realized, like Viktor Frankl, the man who survived the Nazi concentration camp said, he, he who has a why can survive anyhow. I have a very strong why right now. My whole existence seems to be pointing towards bringing this tool into fruition. So, for anything forward, if I don't have a why for it, there's no point forcing myself to do it. Because life's just too short. And it's not even that it's like the nice feel-good thing to do. I just don't think it works to do things that you don't have a why for. Find things that you passionately hate and try to solve them. Find things you really love and work on them. People will say you can't make money, you can't do that. But you know what? Girls make money off OnlyFans. I think there's anything in the world you can do and you can make money off of it as long as you're passionate about it. If you're not, then there is no strong why and you'll never build something someone else will like, so no one will use it. Like a bad video, a bad article, a bad product. Who, who would want to use something just forcefully done for money's sake? Everyone has abundance and wealth now, except third world country people, unfortunately. And the only thing that works now with abundance is finding something you love and then paying for it. You're not forced to buy anything anymore. It's time to keep going. Even though there's doubts, there's frustrations. Just because the times get tough doesn't make the plan bad.